Welcome back to the Dread Savage Labyrinth. Round 42 now. Huh. There's nothing in here. What a bunch of choo choos! Oh, oh, whoa. Watch out for the choo choos! The electric ones, I did not want to do the spin attack on them. Here's the plan I knew. I'll use the bombs on them. Once it explodes, every one of them will be stunned. And you can just annihilate them. All but one survived. Not anymore. Oh, wow. Oh, okay, there. I'm okay. Calm down, Knuckles. Mm. Alright. Round 43. Oh, that doesn't look too suspicious. There's a switch right there. Will you hit it? Out come the whiz robes! Hello! Goodbye! Oh, he got hit by the fire! I could just hit him once. And he's out. Ah, round 44. Ah, this looks like a bunch of joy pendant holders in the dark. I don't know what makes this wind temple thing. It just seems that way. No, yeah, they're everywhere. There you are. That should be all of them. Yeah. Alright, round 45. And I think it was this room. Oh, no, it wasn't this room. Okay, Redeads and Stalpos. Okay, how am I gonna approach this? Oh, that one went well. Watch this, watch him, watch him. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I think he's far enough for me to take. Come on, I have enough time. I'm hitting him with a boomerang, but not his head. I got him. And Stalpos out. What about the other one? Nice performance. Okay. Oh, I thought I had another hit in there. Alright, there's another redid. Oh, and that was a failed jump. He got me. Ow, 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 take that. Uh, okay, that's a safe distance. Uh, I hate redeads. Uh, round 46. Uh, let me see. Yes, it was this room here. During my practice session, I think, I was in here, and then I got called upon to do something else, so I had to pause the game. And after like 10 minutes, I come back and I see the, would you like to continue playing screen? I said yes, and then I'm back at outset with only three hearts of life. Well, I have all my hearts, I just had three hearts filled. And I'm thinking, did I just get a game over? I think the game glitched on me, unpaused, and just left me there to die. So, as of today, I'm calling that an unofficial game over. It has to be official when I see the words. My buddy Wayne teases me about saying, Hey, you got a game over on Wind Waker. I'm like, I didn't see the words, it doesn't count. Well, let me just tell you, it's tough arguing with me. 
so what I say goes. It was unofficial. I didn't see the words. So there's my story, and I'm sticking with him. And that damn god idiot wants to hit me! What the? No! Where are you? Stop hitting me with your stick! Ah, uh, much better. We have some more potions left. Really don't want to take the elixir soup unless it is really necessary. Alright, round 47. Whiz robes and two iron knuckles. Ah, uh, whiz robes out of the way. Oh, black iron knuckle. I use a... I always call them super iron knuckles just because they were a different color, but there's so many colors, I'm just going to call them by their appropriate color. One without a helmet, one without armor. Ow! He just hit me while I was... Attacked parrying from behind, or whatever it's called. Yeah, I think it's, I think it's called the parry. Now parrying is blocking with your sword. Well, it's back slicing, I think it was called. I know Twilight Princess gave it a name, but I just can't think of it off the top of my head now. Alright. Round 48. Oh dear. A lot of bombs and stealth forces. Here's a little strategy I learned. Get close to them. They'll begin spinning. Bomb will blow them apart. And voila! You don't even have to do the boomerang part on them to knock them to pieces. They'll blow themselves up. <laughs> gotcha. Spinning, 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 break apart. And get hit. And now round forty-nine. The last one full of enemies. And look what it has. Four black iron knuckles. Oh wait, actually that's I don't know what color that is. It's more like a reddish violet. Uh, that's hard fighting four of them at once. Walk on to the closest one. And you'll make it through. Well, a double parry. I don't understand how I'm hitting some of them if they don't have armor. I guess I'm hitting them on the head as soon as I jump back up from the parry? Uh, not quite sure. Alright, one of them out. He's without his armor. I think they all don't have their armor on. He's out, ow. Yeah, watch the walls too. Those Moblin statues will breathe fire on you. Well, that's it. Now we made it to floor 50. And well... There's our prize. After a long, tedious battle, we finally find the last and final heart piece. The last heart container is filled. 20 hearts of life. Oh man, that was a hard fight.
might sound worthless, but I make it worth it. We finally got all the hearts. Oh, that fun, folks. Now it's time to get down to business. We gotta go and find all those Triforce charts. Well, let me look at my incredible chart here. Okay, it's only four more I haven't get. Looks like Overlook, Private Oasis, Stone Watchers, and the Ghost Ship. Oh. But we have a hard time getting on the Ghost Ship. So we need to head to Diamond Steep Island real quick. And the hookshot is one of those items that will be allowed for use while in the boat. Like the boomerang, bow and arrow, grappling hook. That's it. Let me look at my uh, treasure charts to see what sort of treasure I did not get. There's only two more left, remember? Uh, yeah, that's Northern Fairy Island there. I guess I was just checking. Alright. Off the Diamond Steep Island because something involving the ghost ship is there. I'll explain it once we grab it. Not gonna be fishing out rupees anymore. Why bother? Once we get these Triforce charts deciphered from Tingle, money ain't really gonna be an issue anymore. I mean, it's not like in uh, Twilight Princess where they're used for the magic armor. Magic armor here is consumed with magic. But this was because there was no magic usage in uh, Twilight Princess. Yeah, well. Yeah, we know. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Way up. Hook shot the tree. Where's the tree? There's one. Let's get up to the next tree. Up above is a cave for us to enter. Well, actually, a hole. Inside, we will find the, the thing we're looking for. Item hunting part three to be continued. <laughs> 